If you are a regular commuter like me, I guess you encounter that kind of scene almost every day, as well as this sign. But what does this really mean? Especially for public buses just like this or this. It can be seen in any public transport all over the world. This serves as a reminder to give the seats that are close to the front door of the vehicle to people with a disability, pregnant, and elderly. But why is it still hard for others to give these seats to the oldies? In the Philippines, PWDs have the Accessibility Law, which mandates that these stickers must be on public transport to remind the public of the rights and the needs of PWDs. But for the elderly, the case was different. So when you look deeply in the existing laws just like this and this, it doesn't hardly state that the priority seating is for them, unlike how the accessibility law works for the PWDs. That is also why in March 2017, Senator Grace Poe filed an order to mandate designated priority seating for the elderly in all public utility transportation. She proposed that the other passengers might use the seats but should give it to the seniors as soon as they are on board. I went to Senate's official site to check the status of the bill, but unfortunately it says pending in the committee. I also checked the official gazette but it shows that the expanded Senior Citizens Act of 2010 is still not amended. I don't know if these sites are not just updated or the bill is not yet passed. But one thing is for sure, the some bus operators are already doing the right thing. Also for the record, I tried to ask Senator Grace Poe and the LTFRB to answer my questions, but sadly, I think they haven't read my messages yet. But I guess my only point here is, we should just ask ourselves, do we really need a bill, a law, or serious fine to give up our seats for a lawless and lawless? Or should we just stop being insensitive and stop pretending that we're asleep and start showing some courtesy? I don't know. You tell me.